Well, good evening. Happy Sunday. Welcome back. A mostly cloudy evening at across the Bayfront and downtown Corpus Christi. Temperature wise, it's not too bad. We had a high of 85 here in Corpus Christi. We're cooling down slowly under mostly cloudy skies. 82 on the thermometer. This observations from the airports and notice the winds from the southeast at 21 miles an hour. Picking up that dew point running in the lower to middle 70s, which is creating a more humid feel out there this evening and we'll continue to do so for the next day or so 85 the high temperature here in the city 88 near Alice near 90 out west of Corpus Christi 86 in Kingsville 83 the high temperature in Rockport and 82 over Port A temperatures right now. Yeah, cooling down, but not by much expect a warm and humid evening up ahead temperatures in the lower to middle 80s out across the board from 85 in Mathis to 84 in foul furious 81 in Port A and 84 in Flower Bluff. Now here's the setup. We have clouds out east of Corpus Christi. You'll see a lot of them are kind of dissipating and they move north and northeast closer to Houston and East Texas. But the uh, big story, no rain from Brownsville to uh, Amarillo. The whole state of Texas is mostly quiet on this Sunday night to wrap up the weekend. Tomorrow, a high near 87, basically a carbon copy. Morning clouds clearing out to sunshine in the afternoon and evening. Temperatures a few degrees above average, but notice the change. It comes in on Tuesday and until Wednesday. Temperatures about 20 degrees cooler in the afternoon, also in the late nights and early mornings in the lower to middle 60s. Now here is the uh, statewide temperature uh, trend. You can see out north of San Angelo, 46 in Lubbock, 34 in Amarillo, near freezing out in the Texas Panhandle. Now this is the cold front that is going to work into Corpus Christi late Monday night, early Tuesday morning. Here's future radar. We'll time it out for you. Uh, you know, by tomorrow this time, it'll be pushing near San Antonio, the Texas Hill Country. And with the frontal passage early Tuesday morning in the Corpus Christi, yeah, we're expecting a few pop up showers here and there, but you'll see how cold this air mass is going to be north of San Antonio. Some wintry mix, some snowfall in the Texas Panhandle. Not going to see any of that here in the city nor in South Texas, but we'll see some scattered rainfall Tuesday and into early Wednesday morning before things clear up by Wednesday night. And we'll see mostly clear skies Wednesday night, Thursday and Friday. Now, how cold is it going to be here in the city? Not chilly, not cold, but will be cooler. Temperatures will be about 15 to 20 degrees cooler again in the afternoons and the late nights. Here's the temperature trend, a high of 87 for tomorrow near 90 with higher humidity. And then watch this fall off from the upper 80s near 90 to the lower 70s. And we stay in the 70s for the most part through the week and then near 80 by next weekend. OK, to the tropics, we have a tropical storm at Zeta. Max winds have bumped up at about 50 miles an hour. Higher wind gets up to 65 and you'll see where it is in the Western Caribbean Sea. Now, since the update from uh, the 4 a.m. Uh, 4 p.m. advisory, I should say, and from this morning and late last night, it hasn't moved much. In fact, uh, the movement is stationary at this point and it is uh, near hurricane strength and it will become a hurricane as it nears the Yucatan later on uh, in the next couple of days. As it moves north into the Gulf of Mexico, it'll make landfall somewhere near Louisiana late Wednesday into early Thursday. So not a threat for the coastal bend. All right, seven day forecast near 90 for your Monday. Partly cloudy to, to uh, mostly sunny, high near 87. Watch that fall off with the cold front temperatures in the 70s for the next four days from Tuesday to Friday with a nice looking weekend for Halloween.